Listening test. In this section, you'll demonstrate your ability to understand spoken English. This is a shortened version of the TOEIC listening test with half the usual number of questions. You don't need to write anything down. Answers are provided immediately after each question. There are four parts and directions will be given for each. Let's begin. Let's kick off with part one, listening photographs. Get ready to analyze some images and pick the best response. Number one. A. A worker is giving instructions to a colleague. B. People are working at a construction site. C. An engineer is reviewing construction plans. D. A group of engineers is discussing a project in an office. The correct answer is C. An engineer is reviewing construction plans. Number 2. A. A group of tourists is walking through a shopping mall. B. Two people are cooking in a kitchen. C. Several workers are repairing a road. D. People are standing in a train station using electronic devices. The correct answer is D. People are standing in a train station. Number 3. A. A waiter is taking an order from a customer. B. A group of friends is shopping for clothes. C. A man is working on his laptop in a shopping mall. D. People are checking in at a hotel. The correct answer is C. A man is working on his laptop in a shopping mall. Number 4. A. People are boarding a plane. B. A group of students is studying for an exam. C. A woman is writing on a chalkboard in a mall. D. A man is reading a book in a park. The correct answer is C. A woman is writing on a chalkboard in a mall. Number 5. A. Two people are cooking in a kitchen. B. Several workers are fixing a road. C. Two people are discussing a presentation in an office. D. A group of people is walking through a park. The correct answer is C. Two people are discussing a presentation in an office. Number 6. A. A group of people is having a meeting in an office. B. A woman is jogging in a park. C. Several people are working in a construction site. D. A man is sitting at a restaurant table using a tablet. The correct answer is D. A man is sitting at a restaurant table. Now, let's move on to part two. Listening, question response. Time to sharpen your listening skills and pick the correct replies. Number one. Did you finish the report from Mr. Thompson? A. The presentation is at 3 p.m. B. No, I didn't go skiing. C. I will complete it by tomorrow. The correct answer is C. I will complete it by tomorrow. Number 2. How many people attended the event? A. It was yesterday. B. About 50 people. C. Next time, maybe. The correct answer is B. About 50 people. Number 3. Did you see the new manager? A. I usually drive to work. B. No, I don't have the details. C. Yes, I met her this morning. The correct answer is C. Yes, I met her this morning. Number 4. Who authorized the purchase? A. It was expensive. B. I need to purchase something. C. Mr. Peterson did. The correct answer is C. Mr. Peterson did. Number 5. What time does the flight depart? A. Yes, I've finished packing. B. At 6 in the evening. C. I prefer driving. The correct answer is B. At 6 in the evening.
Number six. How do you like your new office? A. I commute by bus. B. It's spacious and well lit. C. It's on the fifth floor. The correct answer is B. It's spacious and well lit. Number seven. Are you joining us for lunch? A. The new restaurant opened yesterday. B. Yes, I'd love to. C. I brought my lunch. The correct answer is B. Yes, I'd love to. Number eight. Is the printer working now? A. Yes, it has been fixed. B. No, we need to call the technician. C. The printer is in the office. The correct answer is A. Yes, it has been fixed. Number nine. When is the deadline for the project? A. Let's ask the manager. B. It's due next Monday. C. We can extend it. The correct answer is B. It's due next Monday. Number 10. Where should I park my car? A. It's a company car. B. In the underground garage. C. Yes, I have a car. The correct answer is B. In the underground garage. Number 11. Where did you buy that new laptop? A. From the electronics store downtown. B. I bought a new one last month. C. Yes, it's very fast. The correct answer is A. From the electronics store downtown. Number 12. Who will be leading the meeting? A. Yes, I've prepared the documents. B. The meeting is at 3 p.m. C. Mr. Johnson from our. The correct answer is C. Mr. Johnson from our. Great job so far. Next is part three. Listening, conversations. Listen carefully to short dialogues and answer the questions that follow. Number one. Have you booked your flight for the business trip yet? Not yet, but I plan to do it tonight. Make sure to get a morning flight. Will do. When does the woman want the man to book the flight? A. In the morning. B. In the evening. C. In the afternoon. The correct answer is A. In the morning. Number two. We need to finalize the agenda for the staff meeting. Yes, I've drafted a preliminary one. Can we review it now? Sure, let's go over it in the conference room. I'll bring my notes. Where will they review the agenda? A. In the manager's office. B. In the conference room. C. In the break room. The correct answer is B. In the conference room. Number three. Have you filed the expense report yet? Not yet. I'm planning to do it this afternoon. Okay. Just remember to include the receipts. I will. Thanks for the reminder. When will the man file the expense report? A. This morning. B. This afternoon. C. Tomorrow. The correct answer is B. This afternoon. Number four. Are you attending the business trip to Chicago next month? Yes, I am. My flight is booked for March 10th. Have you received the itinerary? Not yet, but I expect it soon. When is the man's flight to Chicago? A. March 15th. B. March 10th. C. March 5th. The correct answer is B. March 10th. Number 5. I'm having trouble with my laptop. Can you help? Sure. What's the issue? It won't connect to the Wi-Fi. Let me take a look. Maybe it's a settings problem. What is the man's problem? A. He can't connect to the Wi-Fi. B. His laptop is broken. C. He can't send emails. The correct answer is A. He can't connect to the Wi-Fi. 
Number six. Could you review this presentation for me? Of course. When do you need the feedback? By tomorrow afternoon would be great. I'll have it done by then. When does the woman need the feedback? A. By tomorrow morning. B. By this afternoon. C. By tomorrow afternoon. The correct answer is C. By tomorrow afternoon. Number seven. Do you know if the meeting room is available this afternoon? Yes, I checked, and it's free after 2 p.m. Great. I'll book it from 2.30 to 3.30 then. Excellent. I'll be there. What time is the meeting room available? A. After 5 p.m. B. In the morning. C. After 2 p.m. The correct answer is C. After 2 p.m. Number 8. Can you send me the sales report before the end of the day? Absolutely. I'm just finishing it up right now. Great. I'll look for it in my inbox later. You'll have it by this afternoon. When will the sales report be sent? A. By the end of the day. B. This afternoon. C. Tomorrow morning. The correct answer is B. This afternoon. Number 9. Did you finish the quarterly report? Not yet. I'm still working on the financial section. We need to submit it by the end of the day. I know. I'm planning to have it done by 3 p.m. When does the report need to be submitted? A. By the end of the day. B. By noon. C. By tomorrow. The correct answer is A. By the end of the day. Number 10. Can you join the team lunch on Friday? I'd love to, but I have an appointment at 1 p.m. instead. That's a shame. Maybe next time. Definitely. Why can't the man join the team lunch? A. He's on vacation. B. He has another meeting. C. He has an appointment. The correct answer is C. He has an appointment. Number 11. Could you review the financial report before our meeting tomorrow? Sure. I'll look it over tonight and give you my feedback. Excellent. Thanks for your help. No problem at all. When will the woman review the report? A. During the meeting. B. Tonight. C. Tomorrow morning. The correct answer is B. Tonight. Number 12. How was your meeting with the new client? It went well. They seemed very interested in our proposal. That's great news. When do they want to start the project? We're planning to begin next Monday. When will the project with the new client start? A. Next Wednesday. B. Next Monday. C. This Friday. The correct answer is B. Next Monday. Let's dive into part four. Listening talks. You'll hear brief talks or speeches, so stay focused for the questions. Number one. Ladies and gentlemen, join us for the grand opening of our new art gallery this Friday at 6 p.m. We're excited to showcase contemporary works by local artists. Light refreshments will be provided and you'll have the opportunity to meet the artists and discuss their pieces. We look forward to celebrating with you. What time is the grand opening? A. 7 p.m. B. 6 p.m. C. 5 p.m. The correct answer is C. 6 p.m. Number 2. The town's annual charity run will take place this Saturday starting at 7.30 a.m. Participants are encouraged to arrive early for registration and warm-up activities. The route will cover 5 kilometers through the city park. All proceeds will go towards local children's hospitals. What is the length of the charity run route? A. 5 kilometers. B. 10 kilometers. C. 3 kilometers. The correct answer is A. 5 kilometers. Number 3. Thank you for attending our annual business summit. This year's focus is on sustainable growth and innovation. 
Make sure to visit the breakout sessions in the afternoon. Lunch will be served at 12 p.m. in the main hall. We hope you network and gain valuable insights today. What is the focus of this year's business summit? A. Sustainable growth and innovation. B. Networking opportunities. C. Product launches. The correct answer is C. Sustainable growth and innovation. Number four. Good afternoon, volunteers. Your task today is to help plant trees in the community park. Make sure to follow the planting guidelines provided and wear the necessary protective gear. Your efforts are crucial in making our community greener and healthier. Thank you for your hard work. What is the task for the volunteers today? A. To distribute flyers. B. To help plant trees in the community park. C. To clean the park. The correct answer is B. To help plant trees in the community park. Number 5. Attention shoppers! Our store is having a big sale this weekend, with discounts up to 50% off. The sale includes items from all departments. Come early to catch the best deals. Thank you for choosing to shop with us. What is the maximum discount available during the sale? A. 40%. B. 50%. C. 30%. The correct answer is A. 50%. Number 6. Welcome to the Downtown Farmers Market. Open every Saturday from 8 a.m. to 2 p.m. We offer fresh produce, artisanal bread, handmade crafts, and more. Don't miss our cooking demonstrations at 11 a.m. Remember to bring your reusable bags and support local farmers. When does the farmer's market open? A. 2 p.m. B. 8 a.m. C. 10 a.m. The correct answer is C. 8 a.m. Number 7. Welcome to our annual community health fair. We have a wide range of activities lined up, including free health screenings, fitness classes and informational booths. Don't forget to visit our blood donation van located near the main entrance. Together, let's promote a healthier lifestyle. What event is being promoted? A. A free fitness class. B. A blood drive. C. Annual community health fair. The correct answer is B. Annual community health fair. Number 8. Hello. And welcome to our cooking seminar. Today, the chef will demonstrate how to prepare a three-course meal using seasonal ingredients. Make sure to take notes and ask questions after the demonstration. We hope you enjoy and get inspired to cook more at home. What will the chef demonstrate today? A. How to prepare a three-course meal using seasonal ingredients. B. How to bake a cake. C. How to make a quick snack. The correct answer is B. How to prepare a three-course meal using seasonal ingredients. Number 9. Attention passengers, the next train to Central City will depart from Platform 5 at 2.15 p.m. Please ensure you have your tickets ready and arrive at the platform at least 10 minutes before departure. Thank you for choosing our services. What time will the next train to Central City depart? A. At 1.45 p.m. B. At 2.15 p.m. C. At 2.30 p.m. The correct answer is B. At 2.15 p.m. Number 10. We are pleased to announce that our restaurant now offers vegan and gluten-free options to cater to diverse dietary preferences. Check out our new menu featuring healthy and delicious meals that everyone can enjoy. Visit us for a delightful dining experience. What new options does the restaurant offer? A. Vegan and gluten-free options. B. Only desserts. C. Spicy dishes. The correct answer is B. Vegan and gluten-free options.
Number 11. Our community library offers a wide selection of books, magazines, and digital resources. We hold reading programs for all ages and workshops on various topics. Membership is free, and we encourage everyone to make use of this wonderful facility. Visit our website for more details. What does the community library offer besides books? A. Sports equipment. B. Magazines and digital resources. C. Travel brochures. The correct answer is C. Magazines and digital resources. Number 12. Welcome to the Art Gallery's annual exhibition. This year's theme is Nature and the Human Spirit. The exhibition is open daily from 10 a.m. to 6 p.m., with guided tours available on weekends. Be sure to visit our gift shop for unique souvenirs. What is this year's theme for the exhibition? A. Modern Art. B. Nature and the Human Spirit. C. Historical Art. The correct answer is A. Nature and the Human Spirit. Reading Test In this section, you'll demonstrate your ability to understand written English. This is a shortened version of the TOEIC Reading Test with half the usual number of questions. No need to rush, just follow along and answers will be provided after each question. There are three parts, and directions will be given for each. Let's begin. Time for the reading section. Let's start with part five. Incomplete sentences. Fill in the blanks with the correct words. Number one, the project is delayed. Lack of resources. A, for, B, because of, C, without, D, in spite of, The correct answer is B. Because of. Number two. We are. Finish the report by Friday. A. Plan. B. Planning. C. Plans. D. Planning to. The correct answer is D. Planning to. Number three. She is looking forward. The new project. A. On. B. At. C. For. D. Two. The correct answer is D. Two. Number four. We're used. Working late hours during busy periods. A. For. B. Two. C. On. D. With. The correct answer is B. 2. Number 5. She is looking forward. Your feedback. A. To receive. B. Receiving. C. To receiving. D. Receive. The correct answer is C. To receiving. Number 6. He suggested. A break before continuing the meeting. A. Takes. B. Taking. C. To take. D. Take. The correct answer is B. Taking. Number 7. He is interested. Learning more about the new software. A. To. B. In. C. On. D. At. The correct answer is B. In. Number 8. The documents. Sent out by tomorrow. A. Is being. B. R. C. Have to. D. Need to be. The correct answer is D. Need to be. Number 9. He apologized. Arriving late to the conference. A. On. B. About. C. For. D. Two. The correct answer is C. For. Number 10. Would you like to the event? A. Go. B. Went. C. To go. D. Going.
The correct answer is C. To go. Number 11. They were tired to continue working late into the night. A. So. B. More. C. Very. D. Two. The correct answer is D. Two. Number 12. We must submit the report. The end of the day. A. At. B. By. C. On. D. In. The correct answer is B. By. Next up is Part 6. Reading. Text completion. Complete each text by choosing the best answer for the single gap. Number 1. Attention. All team members must submit their quarterly reports by the end of the month. Failure to do so will In penalties, thank you, management. A. Result. B. Resulted. C. Resulting. D. Results. The correct answer is A. Result. Number 2. Dear employees, Please be reminded that the office will be for the holidays from December 24th to January the 2nd. Happy holidays. A. Closure. B. Close. C. Closed. D. Closing. The correct answer is C. Closed. Number 3. Dear all, we are excited to announce that the company picnic will be held in Central Park on June 5th. Hope to see you all there. Cheers, Social Committee. A. Indoorly. B. Outdoors. C. Outside. D. Indoor. The correct answer is B. Outdoors. Number 4. Due to unforeseen circumstances, the company picnic has been until further notice. We apologize for any inconvenience this may cause. A. Postponed. B. Postponement. C. Postponing. D. Postpone. The correct answer is A. Postponed. Number 5. Please ensure that all expenses are A. By the end of the month. Thank you, Finance Department. A. Reported. B. Reports. C. Reporting. D. Report. The correct answer is A. Reported. Number 6. 2. IT Department from Jane Roberts. Subject. Password reset request. I am unable to access my email account. Could you please help me? My password. A. Resetted. B. Resetting. C. Resets. D. Reset. The correct answer is D. Reset. And finally, Part 7. Reading. Reading Comprehension. Get ready to read passages and answer questions based on them. Let's finish strong. Number 1. Attention. All employees due to maintenance work. The building's air conditioning system will be turned off for repairs this Saturday from 8 and key a.m. to 5 and a p.m. We apologize for any inconvenience this may cause, and we appreciate your understanding. Facilities Management Why will the air conditioning be turned off? A. For maintenance work. B. To upgrade to a new system. C. To reduce energy costs. The correct answer is a. For maintenance work. Number 2. Dear Patrons, We are pleased to announce that our library will now offer extended hours on weekends. Starting this Saturday, the library will be open from 9 a.m. to 9 p.m. on both Saturday and Sunday. Come visit us for an extended reading experience. Warm regards, Library Management. What is the change in library hours? A. Weekday closures. B. 24-7 opening. C. Extended hours on weekends.
The correct answer is C. New membership requirements. Number 3. Dear valued customers, we are thrilled to announce the launch of our latest product, the Smart Home Security System. To celebrate, we are offering a 10% discount on all pre-orders made this month. Visit our website to learn more and place your order today. What is the purpose of the announcement? A. To announce a sale. B. To announce a new product launch. C. To announce a website update. The correct answer is B. To announce a store closure. Number 4. Dear travel enthusiasts, join us for an exciting webinar on Exploring Europe on a Budget next Wednesday at 7 p.m. Learn tips and tricks for making the most of your travel experience without breaking the bank. Visit our website to register and secure your spot. What is the topic of the webinar? A. Business travel tips. B. Luxury travel destinations. C. Exploring Europe on a budget. The correct answer is C. Sustainable tourism. Number 5. Good morning, team. As part of our sustainability initiative, we are implementing a recycling program in the office. Separate bins will be provided for paper, plastic, and glass. Let's all do our part to reduce waste and protect the environment. What is the new office initiative? A. Hiring more staff. B. A recycling program. C. Extending office hours. The correct answer is B. A recycling program. Number 6. Dear users, our customer service hours will extend starting next month. We will now be available from 8 a.m. to 8 p.m., Monday through Sunday, to assist you better. We are committed to providing exceptional service and support. What is changing in the customer service hours? A. Weekend support only. B. Extended service hours. C. Shortened service hours. The correct answer is B. Extended service hours. Number 7. Please be advised that the car park adjacent to the main office building will undergo maintenance from July 12th to July 15th. During this period, all employees are requested to use the alternate parking lot located at 456 Elm Street. We regret any inconvenience caused and appreciate your cooperation. What is the main topic of the notice? A. Office relocation. B. New parking regulations. C. Parking lot maintenance. The correct answer is C. Parking lot maintenance. Number 8. Attention. All staff, the company's quarterly financial report has been released and is available on the intranet for your review. We have seen significant growth and appreciate everyone's hard work. Please check the report for detailed information. Regards, finance team. What is the main topic of this message? A. Release of the financial report. B. Information about company policies. C. Announcement of a new staff member. The correct answer is A. Release of the financial report. Number 9. Attention all gym members. From next Monday, we will be extending our closing hours to 11 p.m. on weekdays. This decision comes after numerous member requests. We hope this change will better accommodate your fitness schedules. Thank you for your feedback. What change is being announced? A. Reduced membership fees. B. Extended closing hours on weekdays. C. Addition of new fitness classes. The correct answer is B. Extended closing hours on weekdays. Number 10. Please be informed that our office will be closed on Friday, December 25th, in observance of the holidays. Normal operations will resume on Monday, December 28th. We wish you and your family a joyful holiday season. What is the main purpose of this notice? A. To provide holiday safety tips. B. To inform about office closure. 
C. To announce a new service. The correct answer is B. To inform about office closure. Number 11. Dear subscriber, we are thrilled to introduce our new line of eco-friendly products, available starting next week. These products are made from sustainable materials and reflect our commitment to the environment. Stay tuned for exclusive discounts for our loyal customers. Best Green Tech Team. What is the announcement about? A. A change in company policy. B. A new line of eco-friendly products. C. An upcoming event. The correct answer is B. A new line of eco-friendly products. Number 12. Dear students, as the end of the semester approaches, please ensure that all library books are returned by Friday, May 21st. Late returns will incur a fine. We appreciate your cooperation in maintaining our library resources. Best, library staff. What is the deadline for returning library books? A. By Monday, May 17th. B. By Wednesday, May 19th. C. By Friday, May 21st. The correct answer is C. By Friday, May 21st. Number 13. Dear readers, we are excited to launch our new monthly newsletter featuring company news, employee spotlights, and industry trends. The first issue will be sent out on January 15th. Stay tuned. Regards, the editorial team. What is the purpose of this newsletter? A. To promote a sale. B. To announce layoffs. C. To feature company news and trends. The correct answer is C. To feature company news and trends. Number 14. Notice. The elevator in Building B will be undergoing repairs from Tuesday, October 5th to Friday, October 8th. During this period, please use the stairs or the elevator in Building A. We apologize for any inconvenience this may cause and appreciate your understanding. What is the announcement about? A. Elevator repairs in Building B. B. A fire drill in Building B. C. A new parking policy. The correct answer is A. Elevator repairs in Building B. Number 15. To all employees due to maintenance work, the main entrance will be closed from June 10 to June 15. Please use the west side entrance during this period. We apologize for the inconvenience. Regards, Facilities Management. Which entrance should employees use during the maintenance period? A. West side entrance. B. Main entrance. C. East side entrance. The correct answer is A. West side entrance. Number 16. Our restaurant will be launching a new menu next week, featuring a variety of healthier options and gourmet dishes. Be sure to visit us and try these delicious additions. What is happening next week? A. Launching a new menu. B. Offering discounts. C. Undergoing renovations. The correct answer is A. Launching a new menu. Number 17. We are excited to announce that our new fitness center will be opening next month. The center will offer a range of classes, modern equipment, and personal training services. Membership details and sign-up information will be provided soon. What will the new fitness center offer? A. Free memberships. B. Outdoor activities only. C. Classes, equipment, and training. The correct answer is C. Limited services. Number 18. Dear members, we want to inform you about a new feature on our mobile banking app which now includes fingerprint authentication for enhanced security. Make sure to update your app to access this feature. Sincerely, the bank team. What is the new feature in the mobile banking app? A. Face ID. B. 
fingerprint authentication. C. Voice recognition. The correct answer is B. Fingerprint authentication.